Hello and welcome back to Wall Street Training's Complex Leverage Buyout Modeling. We have already at this point created our LBO summary, our sources and uses, and all of our deal structure, as well as all the inputs and our switches to the model. We will now focus our attention so on the balance. In 32, we're going to take the same methodology as we did for Goodwill as well as Revolver. We're going to grab our pro forma capital structure amounts. That will be what should appear in column J. And then we're going to minus column H because, again, we only want the change in our balances. Because column H, column J takes the sum of H and I because it takes the sum, we're going to go ahead and make sure we minus it out. So H32 is all set. I want you to go to I32 and let's do the following. Equals sum SUM, open parentheses, LBO summary tab, control page up twice. The first set of long-term debt you have is V36 and V37 on the LBO summary, my tranche one and two, comma. V42 through V44, hit enter. Again, LBO summary, V36 through 37, 42 through 44. These numbers are the total debt long term that's not our revolver. And when you hit F2 to go back to edit mode here, now when you hit a minus, now when you hit F2 again so you can now navigate using your cursor keys, hit left arrow to H32, hit enter. You should have a total of 10,445 in your column J, my pro forma balance, and my long term debt is 6,500. Here's the formula once again. Please take the time to match this. Let's quickly check our, our total debt. If I quickly took the sum of my revolver in J28 and J32, I select both of those and you see the sum pop up 10,835. Doesn't that 10,835 ring a bell? That was our maximum total debt capacity. We've maxed it out. That was in cell H35 on the LBO summary. But now, if I go back to LBO summary, I took a go, take a look at my total debt. Sure enough, in V46, just highlighted yellow real quick here, 10,835. It matches. And again, I'm going to quickly check on my LBO summary. Again, my implied debt capacity, H32 rather, that was the 10,835. I'm going to go to H34, by the way, on LBO summary, I'm going to unhighlight that yellow, control shift N. And I want you to make one more final observation here on the debt-related stuff. One more final observation here. The total debt capacity additional that we can borrow in this current no refi scenario is 6890. Let's take a look at how that 6890 is broken down in our balance sheet. There you go. I borrowed 390 on the revolver, 65 on the long-term debt. That was my total change in long-term debt, 6890. So all of this matches and is there for a reason.